Hey folks, it's Stu from Evolution Unleashed, and today I have a relatively short video showing you how to use Canva and their brand new AI studio to instantly fix issues with DALI 3 text generation. So DALI 3 is a new image editor from OpenAI. You'll be able to access it through Bing or ChatGPT. Now I prefer ChatGPT because you can change aspect ratios. You can use a lot more of the reasoning. You can post your post and say, create me an image to go with it. Uh, but whichever platform you're using, you're still gonna create images where it's stunning, but the text is sometimes wrong. So we're gonna show you how to use Canva to fix it instantly when you get an image you like. Let me show you what I mean. We'll jump into, uh, here's an image I created in ChatGPT, and you can see it's a very funky image, but we've got some spelling errors, right? So there's the prompt if you wanna see it, you can pause the video. Uh, let me open that for a bit longer. Okay, so that's the prompt that ChatGPT wrote for me for the image. Here's the uh, text, but we've got Claude spelt wrong, we've got guides spelt wrong, uh, unleashed is spelt wrong, and welcome. So we've got four key errors, but I really like the image. If I regenerate, I might lose it. So let's save this image using this button because it downloads in the right format. If you right click and save, you'll often get a WebP or whatever Chrome uh, extension, which won't open in Canva. So once you've done that, you want to go into Canva. So here's Canva, meet Magic Studio. Well, folks, you're about to. We're going to go create a design. And we're going to use the import file. And then we're going to come, I've got the original on my desktop. Okay, so we'll open that. And then that will create this. We want to use it in a new design. We're going to stick to the size that it gave us. So we don't have to worry about resizing. And then here we are in the editor, right? But still no text. We can't do anything. It's just one giant image. Well, this is where Canva's really stepped up their game. The first time you click edit photo, uh, once you open Canva with the new uh, Magic Studio installed, which is automatic, it'll ask you if you want to use the new editor. You definitely want to say yes. So there's uh, five new options. Magic Eraser will allow you to erase a particular aspect. So let's say you didn't want this dude here, you could erase it using this. Magic Expand, notice we didn't come all the way to the edge. So the Magic Expand, you'll see that in a number of other tools, it will just generatively fill any gaps. As you stretch it out, it will just create new image to uh, expand it out, obviously. Magic Edit, so this will allow you to change one thing to another. So we might click that and we might change this and say, uh, make it a blue robot, uh, something like that. You got Magic Grab, which will bring all the graphical elements um, able to be selected. So when you click that, all these people, you'll be able to move them around, all, all these different things where all the layers will come out. We don't want to do that right now. And instead, today we're going to use Grab Text. So we'll click that. And what it does is it scans the image for text and then creates text boxes that you can edit. And even better, it allows you to use whatever font was in the uh, post to start with. So here you can see even the, the weird writing on the wall, we can fix that. We can fix this one. Look, you'd see these are now all text boxes. So let's start here. And look, we can just delete that. Uh, you see there's an extra A in the welcome. Uh, so we want to delete the A. Quickly fix the uh, message here. So it says welcome. We'll put an exclamation mark. Uh, let's capitalize it, eh? So, yep, we can do everything. Oh, that's such good spelling. You're not following me for my spelling, folks, or typing skills. Uh, let's just get that there. Um, so let's center that up a bit better. So we've got this little element here. To get rid of that, we would have to use the other, um, the graphical element grab. And then guides is spelt wrong. So let's just add a capital I. Now we have guides spelt correctly. And then lastly, this little one up here, C-L-A-U-D-E is how we spell Claude. We can even expand it. And as you can see, it's not quite in the right place. So I can reposition and voila, we now have our completed DALI 3 image with correct text. We can now just share, download, or share it straight to mobile, uh, uh, social, and you're done. So folks, real easy, simple way to take wonderful DALI 3 images with bad text. And within a minute or so, you can just fix it up in Canva. So no more faulty text issues.
cool tool. Hope you've enjoyed it. If you like this sort of thing, please subscribe. We've got plenty more AI tutorial and AI videos coming where we'll show you some new possibilities. And if you want to link to our Unleashed family, so you can get into some prompting, we've got that in the description. So really appreciate it. If you like and subscribe, we'll see you in the next one. Peace.